Good morning to all you long roaders. I just wanted to share a little bit of info on what we'll be doing here over the next 12 weeks. So as many of you may have noticed or will be noticing is that we kind of switched from programming. So last year um, we did all mayhem. I kind of adopted that um, a year and a half or so ago when, um, you know, I wanted to, I've, we've tested out many different um, programs out there. For the first nine years, I did all the programming myself, uh, which I really enjoyed, but it came down to a time thing and I wasn't able to put in as much as I could. So now testing out Mayhem, um, adding more, um, kind of what I realized over time is more isn't better, better is better. So what we're gonna be doing is uh, Lee and I kind of uh, creating and doing our own programming from here on out um, and kind of throwing in a different mix. And I just wanted to show you what this 12 weeks is going to look like and what our focus is going to be. But the biggest thing of all of this, whether you have 2024 goals and kind of what you're gonna be seeing me post a lot of is in order to make all those goals come true, whether it is a strength goal, a life goal, whatever the case may be, all you have to do is show up, okay? So many of you put strict pull-ups, lose weight, do this, do that, do the other. If you continue to show up, you hit those 16 days in the month, get to that committed club, all those goals will take care of our, yourselves. We rotate days, midline, from squatting to pressing to gymnastics to all those things. So I guarantee you, if you just show up for yourself in 2024, all them goals will take care of themselves. So that just isn't um, in the gym, but in life in general, just show up, do the work. If you continue to do that, all those things will happen. So quickly again, here's the game plan for this next 12 weeks. Um, yesterday we hit some front squat percentage. We're gonna be focusing on squatting, um, which we're gonna be using this number. If many of you remember a couple years back, we did an EMOM style of front squats and back squats going back and forth with percentages. We're gonna be doing a mix of that again um, coming up over the next 11 weeks to follow. So, but it's all going to be based off your front squat number. So that's why we wanna get that number. We're gonna do some midline stuff, some rota rotational strength core stability work. So hanging, carries, um, raises, bracing, things like that. So that's gonna be focused as well. We're gonna be mixing in there. Um, Olympic lifting, snatch and clean. A lot of it's going to be, we're gonna be starting from the top. So we're gonna be doing a lot of position work um, and using this midline core strength and working on using our hips in that movement and having a good base off the floor. So we're gonna be hitting, uh, I believe we one RM snatching tomorrow or someday later in the week. So we're gonna be hitting those positions is going to be a big focus throughout this um, next 11 weeks. And then we're gonna be doing some pressing. So you're gonna see, I love EMOM style. So you're gonna see a lot of EMOM in all of this. So every minute on the minute, rotating back and forth of movements um, in there. So we're gonna be doing some strict pressing, push pressing, push jerking, and split jerking um, in here. But the main two numbers that we're going to test and then retest in another 12 weeks is the push press but we are going to lead uh, with all four of our pressing cycle or movements in this, um, in this strength cycle to really start from ground up and learning how to brace here at the midline when we're pressing overhead. So that's gonna be a focus that we're gonna be hitting. And then what we're doing today is this gymnastics mixed with a little toe to bar or, uh, and we're building stamina and endurance in the toe to bar over the next 10 to 12 weeks. Um, here and then we're just getting comfortable with being upside down really working on balance whether you want to walk on your hands or not walk on your hands um, Something that as we lose as we get a little bit older um, Is that balance coordination stability that we can go upside down? Um, and be uncomfortable doing that whether it's just a partial wall walk Maybe an inverted or a pike push-up or something along those lines. So again, we're gonna be hitting all these things over the next uh, 12 weeks or so. We're doing some testing this week and then we'll get into the cycle next week. Um, again, I love EMOMs, so you're gonna see a lot of these mixed in with variations going back and forth um, in those over the next 12 weeks. But again, the biggest thing is just showing up for yourself, whether it is in the gym, I believe, 
that if we show up for ourselves in the morning, in the afternoon, whenever, in the gym, all the other things in life will kind of follow up with that and we'll be able to hit those goals. So think, just the easy decision is to pass, but can we show up for ourselves and make all those things happen and make 2024 like the best year yet in meeting our goals, um, whether it is you know, health and wellness goals or personal goals um, ourselves. So that's a little breakdown of what's gonna be happening. Uh, hope to see you in here. Show up, 2024. Peace out.